outlasting coronavirus has been compared to running a marathon. Or four of them like the Good Sport Profile tonight by our Russell Haythorn. One foot in front of the other, you tell yourself you keep going, you keep going. It's not necessarily the distance that motivates Kalika Zarek. Running has kind of been a lifesaver for me. It's the mental fortitude and courage it takes to keep pushing. It is sort of a mental health outlet, if you will. Running has kept her grounded through some of life's most challenging moments. Had a long kind of road with a lot of those things. This past December, she decided to start training for the Happy Camper Ultra Marathon in Westminster. I was training for a 100 mile foot race. But like so many other events. Everyone's been impacted by the virus in different ways. Kalika's race is now canceled. There's a crossroads. You can go one of two ways. You can either let it get you down, feel defeated, or my goal was to kind of keep pu pushing forward to turn it into a charitable event where I could put my training to good use and raise money for um, a worthy cause. So this Friday, she's planning to run the 100 mile race anyway. Some friends and strangers have committed to running part with her to have some some smiling faces cheering me on the furloughed fitness instructor sees this as a way to give back to frontline workers through the denver nonprofit project helping they're actually doing something really amazing for healthcare workers right now and she's learning what it takes to fight through all the pain associated with ultra running believe it or not shot of pickle juice you'll be cramp free in no time <laughs> a mission motivated by all those giving so selflessly. To support people that I'm very grateful for right now. In Niwa, Russell Haythorn, Denver 7.